is up guys EJ here back with another video and today it's going to be my Blu-ray DVD collection for uh, 2020 and the uh, film noir section so let's get into it so first we have uh, The Big Sleep uh, from 1946 with uh, Humphrey Bogart and uh, Lauren Bacall uh, definitely one of my favorite Bogey Bacall uh, films absolutely fantastic movie up uh, next we have uh, Double Indemnity from 1944, fantastic film uh, with uh, Fred McMurray and Barbara Stanwyck, Edward G. Robinson, uh, another one of these Universal Legacy series that I have. Up uh, next we have uh, Gaslight uh, from uh, 1944. With uh, Charles Boyer and Ingrid Bergman, uh, Joseph Cotton, another terrific film. Up next, we have uh, Gilda uh, from 1946 with uh, Rita Hayworth, a uh, film I also have on the uh, Criterion Collection. Fantastic, of course. Up next, we have uh, The Good German uh, from 2006. Yeah, George Clooney and uh, Kate Blanchett, Tobey Maguire. Um, I like this film a lot. Um, yeah, one of my more modern film noir movies. Up next, we have uh, High Sierra uh, from 1941, I believe, with uh, Humphrey Bogart and uh, Ida Lupino. Up next, we have uh, Key Largo uh, from 1948, another great uh, Bogey Bacall film, again with uh, Edward G. Robinson. Ugh, these all came out at once. Uh, up next we have uh, Killer's Kiss uh, from uh, 1955. Yeah, early uh, film by uh, Stanley Kubrick. Um, probably m one of my least favorite Kubrick films. Up next, another Kubrick film, and that is uh, The Killing from 1956. This is absolutely one of my favorites of his, or one of his uh, early favorites, uh, starring Sterling Hayden. Uh, terrific film, The Killing. I, I believe I also have this on Criterion Collection. <clears throat> Up next, we have uh, Kiss Me uh, Deadly uh, from uh, 1947 uh, with uh, Ralph Meeker. Stuff is like all coming out at once here. <laughs> you can hear them sticking together. Uh, up next, we have uh, Kiss of Death, uh, also from uh, 1947. Uh, Victor Mature, Brian Donnelly. Um, really good. Let's so try to get these back in the right order. Ugh, it's going to be a problem here. Wow. Okay, up next, uh, also from uh, 1947, I believe, uh, The Lady from Shanghai with uh, Rita Hayworth and uh, Orson Welles. Up next, we have uh, Laura uh, from uh, 1944, I believe, with uh, Jane Tierney and uh, Dana Andrews. Another one of these Fox film noirs that I have. Uh, yeah. Up next, we have uh, The Lost Weekend. Um, yeah, Oscar winning film from 1945 with uh, Ray Milland and uh, Jane Wyman. Uh, another terrific film. Up next, we have uh, The Maltese Falcon uh, from 1941. Three disc uh, special edition, Humphrey Bogart, Mary Astor, absolutely one of the greatest films of the 40s, absolutely love this film, definitely one of my favorites in this genre. Up next, another more uh, more uh, modern uh, film noir movie, uh, The Man Who Wasn't There from 2001, terrific film, uh, directed by the Coen Brothers with uh, Billy Bob Thornton, Francis McDormand, and uh, James Gandolfini. Um, I absolutely love this film when I initially saw it. Uh, yeah, one of one of the Cohen's most underrated flicks in the last 20 years. <sighs> More stuff stuck together. Here we go. Come on. Ugh. God damn. All right. Up next, we have uh, the Night of the Hunter from uh, 1955. Fantastic film. Great performance by Robert Mitchum. Uh, Shelley Winters also have this on Criterion Collection. Up next, we have uh, Nightmare Alley from uh, 1947 with uh, Tyrone Power. Again, another great Fox Film Noir collection DVD. Up next, we have Out of the Past uh, from 1947. Bob Mitchum, great as well in this. Uh, Jane Greer, Kirk Douglas. Um, yeah, really good film that as well. 
Up next, we have uh, Panic in the Streets uh, from 1950 um, with, uh, I believe, uh, yeah, Charlton Heston is in this film. Another uh, Fox film noir. Up next, we have A Place in the Sun uh, from 1951, uh, Montgomery Clift. Uh, Liz Taylor and uh, Shelley Winters another terrific film all right guys moving on down up next we have uh, the postman always rings twice uh, from 1946 uh, Lana Turner and John Gar Garfield Lana Turner is uh, stunning in this film up next we have uh, the setup uh, from uh, 1949 with uh, Robert Ryan uh, Audrey Totter up next, we have uh, Shadow of a Doubt, Alfred Hitchcock film from uh, 1943, uh, Joseph Cotton and Teresa Wright. Yeah, I watched this during my uh, 2013 uh, 24-hour movie marathon. All right, up next, we have uh, Frank Miller's uh, Sin City, of course, from uh, 2005. Uh, Recut Extended Unrated Edition, really nice edition. Um, just a fantastic film. I absolutely loved it when I initially saw it. Uh, yeah, Bruce Willis, Jessica Alba, uh, Mickey Warwick, Elijah Wood, um, Clive Owen. Uh, I loved everything about Sin City, to be honest. Um, and for some reason, out of order. My shit is all out of order. I've, I've moved so much in uh, recent, uh, in the past year. I've moved like, like, twice in the past year um, so I've had to move my collection a bunch of times and stuff just gets moved out of order when that happens also got the uh, sequel of course in the city a dame to kill for uh, from 2014 yeah Ava Green in this as well you love her Carla uh, Gugino um, or was she in the first one I'm trying to remember <laughs> funnily enough I watched uh, San Andreas last night it was on uh, sci-fi and uh, found myself watching that, and uh, I like her in, in that film. Um, uh, okay, up next we have uh, The Stranger, uh, another uh, great Orson Welles film with uh, Edward G. Robinson and Loretta Young uh, from 1946. Up next we have Strangers on a Train from 1951, uh, Alfred Hitchcock classic, uh, two disc special edition with uh, Farley Granger. Uh, Ruth Roman and Robert Walker, a fantastic film, one of Hitch Hitchcock's best. Um, absolutely love that movie. Up next, we have uh, Sudden Fear uh, from 1952, I believe, with uh, Joan Crawford, uh, Jack Plants, Gloria Graham. Nice uh, Kino video uh, edition here. Most of my Kino videos are all in my silent collection, but whatever. Uh, up next, we have uh, Sunset Boulevard. Uh, special Collector's Edition, absolute classic uh, from 1950, of course, with uh, William Holden and Gloria Swanson. Um, great film directed by Billy Wilder. Absolutely love that. Up next, we have uh, Suspicion uh, from 1941, another Alfred Hitchcock film with uh, Cary Grant and uh, Joan Fontaine. Terrific. Up next, we have uh, This Gun for Hire uh, from 1942 with uh, Alan Ladd and uh, Veronica Lake. Up next, we have uh, To Have and Have Not uh, from 1944, another great Humphrey Bogart and uh, Lauren Bacall film. Um, this and The Big Sleep are, my, are probably my two favorite Bogie Bacall uh, collaborations. Up next, we have uh, Touch of Evil, a uh, fantastic film by Orson Welles. Uh, that he, of course, stars in, along with uh, Charlton Heston, uh, Jeanette Lee uh, from uh, 1958. Just a fantastic film. Up next, we have uh, White Heat uh, from 1945, I believe, with uh, Jimmy Cagney, uh, Virginia Mayo. And uh, last but not least, we have uh, The Woman in the Window. Or uh, I also, I still have uh, the Canadian edition, uh, La Femme. The portrait, is that what it says? I can't read the the bit in the middle. Oh, portrait? I can't tell. Um, anyway, Edward G. Robinson and uh, Joan Bennett uh, from 1945. Yeah, when I did my sort of cleanup of DVDs, um, getting getting rid of my Canadian versions that I unwittingly ended up with, um, this was the one I 
I didn't get to or couldn't find a uh, a good price on a on a regular uh, Region One DVD that I liked. Um, but still working on that. I might have to look into that again soon. Uh, so anyway, that is uh, film noir, uh, a short section, short and sweet, hopefully. Um, so up next will be horror. Um, next to drama and comedy, horror is one of my biggest sections. So this might be four videos I think I'm going to go with uh, for my horror collection. So thank you for watching as always, and until next time, I'll see you. Bon.